What a lovely, lovely day. Absolutely glorious weather here as we welcome you to a football match of considerable significance. Great consequence in this part of the world. We've been talking about this one for a while and they have rolled up to it in fantastic numbers. You should have seen the roads outside the ground in the Aratu leading up to it. It has been bumper to bumper. The traffic has been extraordinary. But the level of expectation is also very, very high. And uh, these supporters who uh, were queuing round the block for their tickets as soon as we knew the date of the fixture, well, now they can't wait for it to begin. And begin it will any second now. This is, of course, the Camp Nou, one of the best known, perhaps the best known of all the venues in European football. Although it's got the juices flowing, and now this. A mouth-watering game, this, between two very high-quality sides. Bentancur, I wonder what you've seen, Jim, over the early moments of the game. Well, I think both teams probably feel it's, it's too early for either to start taking real... He's gone for it! And he's done it! A pretty simple finish in the end, what do you think, Jim? Yeah, and all engineered, Peter, by some smart running and movement. That's already something to admire, but how about the pass? Just wonderful. Loved it. I doubt very much that this was in the script. Jordi Alba drives it forward. Torreira gets it back. Well, he acknowledges that he should have come up with something better there. Yeah, I mean, he, I think he did well to, to spot the run. He just didn't get enough behind it. It happens. And here's Thiago. And the shot! Decent enough try. Good effort, very good effort. He would have at least wanted to make the keeper work, though. Jimenez. Godin goes back to base. Caceres. Hardly anything between the sides. And the score is 1 0. Torreira. He's made sure that that won't get through. And it's played forward. It's beautiful, intricate passing. They are toying with their opponents. Well, they know that their version of what they do is extremely good. I mean, it's a level of possession that leaves the opposition chasing shadows. Llorente. Quick glance at goal. This is promising. Has a hit! Torreira. Cavani. And that's put paid to a promising move. Torreira. And here's the chance to counter. Played out to the right. Oh, well intercepted, really alert to the danger. 
Muslera sends that a long way. Jordi Alba cuts it out. Morata, good take and he's had a look. Morata was alert to the possibilities, but in the end it's fruitless. Oh, terrible mistake. He shoots! Big relief, it just needed better contact. It was more possible than probable, and the outcome backed it up, Peter. Jimenez. Loses his balance and loses the ball. Coming up to half time, leading, and things are looking pretty good. Bentancur tried to play it through. Oh, Peter, his body shape was a giveaway before he made the pass, and its obviousness was, was appreciated. Out towards the flank. Put a stop to that. <laughs> Hoists it forward. He's got options out wide. Spain claiming a corner, and the referee concurs. And this could be the final action of the first half. Bentancur attempts it. Has a goal! And that's it for the first half. A breathless ending. So there you have it. A close sport half of football. But one that still had its moments. But ultimately produced just one goal. A more than decent game up to now. I'm sure they'll be very happy with the first half performance and the scoreline. They'll definitely want to maintain their momentum now and finish the job. Uruguay head for the dressing room in possession of a 1-0 lead. And the game has already resumed here. Well, 1-0 may be good enough, so they may err on the side of caution and, and get more players behind the ball instead of running beyond it. They could even try to, to spoil it from here, we'll see. There were better options before the ball was lost. Easy to save from up here, I know. Ferran Torres. Morata! It's there! Spain are all square. Spain are really pouncing on any straight passes in midfield. We're talking seconds from interception to the back of the net. It's counter-attacking heaven. Spain grab the equaliser and we're all square. Yeah, it's a very good contest with two very good sides and with such great individual talent on show, it could go either way. Rodri. And it's Thiago. Jordi Alba. In comes the cross. It's Thiago! He's missed, but not by that far. 
Thiago did give it a fair old crack and he'll be encouraged to step up again. Laxalt does well to read it and intercepts. Ferran Torres needed to come up with a better ball. Uh, was too timid to make it through the defence. It'll be noted and, and improved upon, I'm sure. Thiago just brushed off the ball there. Gets wrestled off the ball. Ferran Torres. Jordi Alba. Jordi Alba goes looking. Jimenez positions himself well and cuts it out. Could move up a gear here. He gets past his man. He's making good use of his strength there. Just refuses to be out-muscled. Oh, super tackle. They were outnumbered and under the cosh. That had to be spot on, and it was. Dashing forward at pace. Gets away from his opponents. Well, I'm not quite sure he needed to hold up play quite as much as he did then. A couple of his teammates were very annoyed. And now the breakaway. Great strength, too strong for his opponent. Rodri. Caceres, and he's certainly caught him there, it's a free kick. So who is the target now? He's having a look at what's available. Get the better of his opposite number. Torreira. And here's Cavani. Laxalt. And it's Cavani. Oh, no, that's not the ball he wanted. The concentration levels are very good, and so is the commitment. This game could yet yield a winner. Port does well there, alert, and he's big chance! Oh, should have put that away. Well, maybe the tension around this game played a part in that because he should have put them ahead there. And he's straight offside. Target and by quite a way. Okay, it's come to nothing, but it's a warning of further threat on the break. And helps available out wide. Last ditch defending, but that'll do. Good block, but at the expense of a corner. Desperate defending required here. And they've been caught. Goes for it! Brilliant from Ferran Torres! Late in the day, this could well be it! Oh, to keep his nightmare, Peter, he just couldn't pick up on it until it was way too late having so many bodies in front of him.
Spain complete their comeback, and now they only need to hold out for a few minutes. Well, the last moments now, Peter, are going to be very frantic. There's still time for a, a twist or two yet. Very well to intervene. And time is up. Uruguay have some soul searching to do here. Having been in apparent control, they have allowed it to slip away. And after all of that, Jim, what are you thinking? Look, they've been.